In this flex course, I'm going to show you six codes that you can use in the quick launch bar, also known as the search bar, which is up here at the top. So let's go through this quickly. The first one I'm going to show you, and you can use the map search. You'll notice there's more than one way to do something. This is just another way I'm going to show you if you don't want to use the map search feature in Flex. The first thing we're going to do is try to is, is type in price. So if I do 100K to 150K, you'll notice that it's going to show me either vacant land between that price or residential, which in this case includes condos, townhomes, and multifamily units. Let's go ahead and click New Tab. And this is going to show us all of the homes in A or AB status that are between that price range. And you'll notice it's going to show you homes, say, in Monroe or Grand Rapids or Grand Haven or Ludington because it's showing you all of the homes that are in our flex and all of the partners that we have, like RealComp and Mishrick. So it's going to show you everything. So that's how you find if you just do 100K to 150K. We can always do 200K to 300k and it'll show us homes between 200,000 and 300,000 or we can look at lots between 200,000 and 300,000. The second code I want to go ahead and show you is beds, baths, and price. So if we type in let's say we want to do three beds plus sign two baths plus sign 100k and it'll tell you to make sure so you want to look for three bedrooms or more, two baths or more, and $100,000 or more. Yes. Let's go ahead and click New Tab. And it's going to show you all the homes, again, that are only in A or AB status all across the board of Michigan that are within that range of three beds, two baths, and 100000 or more. The next code I want to show you, and not all of these work, uh, for the subdivision, but the cool one is you can type in subdivision. So if I type in sub of, let's do Briarwood, which is located in Okemos, off Okemos Road, it'll say, okay, you want to look at the subdivision of Briarwood. All of the homes that are in A or AB status of Briarwood will say yes. Open in a new tab. And it's going to show us what's available. Right now it's saying there's only one home that's in A or AB status located in Briarwood. Let's go back and let's type in another subdivision. And what I mean is not all subdivisions will be in here. You kind of have to play around with it. But the key points is you're going to type in the word sub of. Sub of, let's do Meadowbrook. Located in Hazlitt. Again, we can look at the lots for sale, if there's any in that neighborhood, or homes in A or AB status. Click on New Tab, and it's going to show us how many homes, if any. Looks like we've got two homes in the Meadowbrook area of Hazlitt that are available in A or AB status. The next code I want to show you is the word near. If you type in the word near, and then you type in the address, and you want to look at a radius around that address. This is how you can do it. So for instance, I'm going to type in 1124 Jackson in Danesville. And the word near correlates to what Flex has automatic for two miles. So it's going to search two miles from this address at 1124 Jackson Street in Danesville. Click New Tab. And it's going to show me that there's three homes in A or AB status that are within two miles of this home at Jackson Street. And you can see this is the actual address right here. So there's two other homes that are around that area. And remember, that's the word near. You want to put the word near and then the address. The next code we're going to do is five miles from and then the address. And this implies this is five miles from that address. So five miles from 1124 Jackson in Danesville. So let's type that in and it tells you down here, okay, you wanna look for five miles radius from 1124 Jackson in Danesville? Yes. 
what homes are available in A or AB status that are five miles surrounding this area? And it's showing me that there's the results of four to five homes that are around this home that are available. Those are some codes that you can use in Flex MLS.